in, Buzz, and welcome to another Epic Mickey episode. And, uh, quick confession there, I just tried to do the uh, Super Mario Galaxy 2 long jump via, you know, A and Z on the nunchuck and Wiimote. Anyway, that's a totally random topic. Let's right go into quests straight away and see what we've got to do. Uh, what was the one we were doing? I think it was this one, wasn't it? Visit the imp but needs a power spark to function. Visit the Emporium and Museum for clues. So let's do that straight away. And uh, I'm not actually going to get clue. I like I'm um, confused. Going to get clued. I'm not actually going to get confused to where the places are this time because I actually kind of know. So uh, let's talk to this guy. He said visit the Emporium. So let's see. You found my back room key. I'll give you something from inside as a reward. Hopefully this power spark is okay with you. Well, that was easy. Uh, um, okay. That's really strange. <laughs> um, that was a lot easier than I thought. Uh, no. No. <sighs> I hate how if you come out of conversation and you try to jump immediately, which is something I tend to do, uh, you actually go straight back into the conversation. I hate it when games do that. That is a little kind of mission for me. Okay, so uh, I'm guessing we have to get another one. So let's go into the museum. Let's go. See what we can do again. We're probably just going to be talk to the guy again and... Uh, is there anyone down here? <laughs> it's just hanging there, okay. Probably got to talk to her. Is it her? I, I, I can't really tell. And yes, that was a damn voice crack. Welcome to the museum. I'm Laura Lee, cl the curator of this place. We don't have much now, but feel free to look around. Uh, see it glowing, yes. What? You need the crazy glowing orb? Well, that's the most interesting sad, huh? Oh, she's crying! That's so bad. Oh, game, you're so sadistic. <sighs> right. So we got a, we've got a uh, quest to get a quest item. Are you kidding me? I'll let you have the power spark if you can find something more interesting to replace it. God damn it. Okay, so we need to find something completely different then. So, I'll see us at the cinema. Let's see what we can do. Uh, that's the other thing. I mean, this game, you know, I've been noticing this especially since last episode. Uh, since we have, uh, have been having all these uh, horrifically repetitive uh, missions, you know that. Uh, okay, so I, yeah, yeah, cool, cool. <laughs> I'm still crappy with locations. I mean, typical Yoshi moment. Uh, it's the, it gives a bit too much away, I'd say, in my opinion. You know, uh, is this a cinema? Yes, it is cool. Um, you know, it gives too much away straight away on the quest info. It kind of says go here and talk to this guy, or I know, I know you'd say a lot of places say that, but it does it so directly for every single quest. I'm thinking, you know what? While I do like a bit of help, I think you may be giving me a bit too much. So, you know, it's just kind of. Yeah. Anyway, I'm guessing we've got to... I'm not going to look at the quest info. I'm going to leave it up to my intuitive mind, which probably doesn't exist anyway. So, what's the betting in two minutes I'll be going to the quest info? Cool. Oh. Anyway, I told you guys I'd be back on a regular uploading schedule. So, here is the second upload schedule thing. Oh, my, look at this cutlass. It's quite the specimen. I'll gladly trade you the password. See, so easy. I mean, really, it's predictable now. Okay, let's get going. We have the uh, spark. And I'm guessing we have got to go see that uh, guy who was really grumpy to us in the last episode about the power sparks. So let's go see him. See what he's got to mode at us now. Uh, okay, camera, do you want to sort yourself out? Thank you. Uh, so, uh, yeah. Nice to be uh, uploading. <laughs> nice to be uploading. Oh dear, my uh, voice cracks. They never get better. Seriously, there's going to be a moment where I stop voice cracking and you probably wouldn't miss it or something. I, I, I'll miss, I won't miss it at all. Now, now, let's see what's happening with this device. Okay, this should be the bit we've been waiting for after all those side quests. I mean, Jesus. Okay, let's see. Fiddle here, adjust that. Voila! A projector screen to us. Time is working perfectly. Ah, so that was the place we went before where all the projectors were. While you were gone, I'll try tinkering with the other projector screen. Good luck, Mickey, and take these e-tickets to help you on an adventure. Ooh, thank you. How many did we get? 20, I think. Cool. Oh, f Okay, that is a flaw with the game and me. I mean, you're going to see that happen to me a lot. You know, I'm just going to... Where am I going? I'm just going to constantly be mashing the A button. Because it's what I do, you know? Like, I think anyone who was uh, the Mario generation, you know, SNES, uh, kind of stuff like... 
a lot of you would argue, hey Yoshi, you're not the SNES generation, you're only 16. Uh, well, yeah, but I kind of grew up with the SNES and N64 and even the NES a bit. You know, I, I've been a good retro gamer my whole life, so uh, I'd still count myself as being, oh, where do we go? Okay, cool. I guess we've got to go in here. Oh my god, magic mirror! Okay, this is really cool. Uh, as, yeah, I haven't been to this bit yet, guys. Uh, this is really awesome. That's really cool. Uh, yeah, because I didn't just say that. Okay, okay, this this get this part of the game is getting really cool now. Uh, I don't know if you guys agree with me. Will that guy hurt me? Yes, he will. And uh, I know that I know the movie they're from, uh, but I just can't think of the names of them. So cool. I mean, they're not just called cards, are they? Are they? I don't know. Um, what was I talking about? I got so sidetracked. I mean, that's typical. But what was I? Um, oh yeah, yes, yes. I mean, like that's the thing. Um, I've always been a retro gamer, and I always will be. I'm. Um, I choose. I don't. I'm. The prop. The. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna stop trying to get up there because that's not gonna work, is it? Do you want to stop doing that, please? Um. I'm gonna bash my own generation here a bit, I think, and I mean a lot of you guys are my own generation, and then you totally have the right to disagree with me, and I'm not gonna be angry at you guys, and you know I don't think any little less of you guys for disagreeing with me on this. But one thing that I kind of find annoying about games now is that both the developers, well, some developers, and uh, nearly got so many of the modern generation players, you know, like Call of Duty. Um, all these like really high-tech Xbox games, which I enjoy as m myself as well. You know, I'm not being hypocritical here, but um, I just find it annoying when people base graphics and you know audio and stuff way over the actual gameplay aspects. I find it really bad that someone. Oh god, I'm talking over a cutscene. You guys don't like that. Hmm. Okay. Uh, <laughs> I'll, I'll continue my rant. I'm, I haven't gone this far to stop now. Uh, you know, to um. Like, I find it so bad that you, c if you were to play like a Mario game now with someone who only plays Call of Duty, they won't enjoy it because they'll think, oh, the graphics are bad, but it's all about the gameplay, you know? I'm sure a lot of you guys will agree with that, so a lot of you guys will disagree with that. Put in the comments, you know, maybe that'll be the question of the uh, episode. Put in the comments what you think about that, because I would, l I really would love to hear what you think. Uh, in Mickey's Puller Team, I d so it's another one of those things where they're trying to show what they're in, but no one can remember. Ha 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 ha. Yeah, I guess no one sees those anymore. I kind of like what Disney's doing with this. Uh, they're actually reliving so many of their old classics through the video game. Uh, it's really quite an awesome way to give uh, people who didn't grow up watching Disney a nice little way to see. So you're going off to Oswald, are you? That sounds dangerous. If you're going to Mickey Junk Mount... Uh, <coughs> Mickey Junk Mountain. That sounds like something Mickey's carrying in his trunk, if you know what I mean. You'll need to fix that bridge. Yo, Mickey's got some junk in his trunk, and I tried to do that awesome, but it went into a voice crack, so I got pissed off. <laughs> what the hell am I doing? There was a gremlin honeyman around here, but he's been missing a while. Seriously, that last sentence was just a bucket of fail, or a junk trunk of fail, I guess you could say. Oh, before I forget, something has been making noise over near the gag factory. Can you go see what it is? It sounds like something might be calling for help. I'd go check it out myself, but, well, you know. Okay, cool, so we are here... <coughs> oh, please, voice. Can you at least make me sound a little no normal for a single episode? I won't mache. I will not mache. Okay, let's see. Is there something in here? Uh, can we do anything with that? No, I guess we can't. Um, cool. Absolutely nothing to see there. Let's talk to this guy. I've been hearing some noises from that safe up there. Someone's in there. I once knew the combination to that safe, but my memory is fuzzy these days. When my mood is down like this, my memory ain't worth a hill of beans. Oh, you dumbass. <laughs> Your house is all pretty and yellow over there, but mine's an utter weak wreck. Uh, an utter weak? Really? If you'd fix it up, I'd probably remember the combination. What do you say? Is that is that bribery? I mean, really. If that's how your mind works without bribery, then that is weird. Okay. Well, let's go find this guy's house and... There it is. Okay, cool. Uh, wow, this is really a wreck. <laughs> Brilliant. Okay. I'm sorry, but this is cool. <laughs> okay, let's do this. So we are going to paint it up, and we get paint buckets along the way to help. Uh, we're going to need to spray the sides. 
Okay. Uh, camera angle. Yeah, I, I, I don't know, like, uh, a lot of you, uh, those of you who have been watching from the start, you'll know how I had the, uh, complaints with the camera angles at the start of the, uh, the game. I don't know, I'm not finding them as bad anymore, but, uh, I'm still finding they're there, which is not good. Oh, and I hate inverted controls. I know a lot of you guys are good with that, but I am just not good. You painted in Moody's house. We should go let him know the task is done. Sweet, let's do that then. Okay, so, uh, right. Yeah, so inverted controls tick me off to an extent of Yoshi madness. It looks great. Thank you so much. Hey, I remember the combination. Oh, typical. Yeah, what a coincidence. Blue sounds like two and red roof makes me think of five. Don't ask why. Five on top of two. Seven. That's it. Seven, five, two. That's the combination. Let's climb one up the building behind me and use it. Be careful up there. Okay, so let's quickly get up there before this episode has to come to an abrupt end and see what we have to do with this. So what was it? Seven, five, two. Oh, so that's why that's there then. Okay. Are you going to jump? Cool. Right then, let's see. Cutscene! Okay, that's gonna squash Moody. <laughs> that was such an epic cutscene. Love it. <laughs> Mickey looks so determined. I mean, why is his face on the inside of it? That must be really freaky. Jesus Christ. <coughs> oh no. Okay, and he sees gremlins instead of ducks. Interesting. What a good likeness. Thank you for rescuing me. I owe you one. Headed to Mickey Junk Mountain? I can help, but I need my wrench. When I tinkered with that telephone in your house, it tricked me into this safe. I came in... I'm... I came in? I'm certain he still has my wrench, so you'll need to go get it back from him. Just let me know when you have it. Okay, and yes, another side quest ho! Uh, okay, I'm just gonna end the episode here, so, uh, as always, guys, thank you for joining me. I, am um, have always been, and always will be, Yoshi to Mario. Don't forget to rate comment and subscribe to both my channel which you can find a link to down in the description as well as the question of the episode which uh, I would love you guys to answer in the comments and Ninbuzz which you should be subscribed to already because you are the awesome people after all. So we, oh, finally we get in the damn car. Let's, we can't even... That's as realistic as we're gonna get. Okay guys thank you for joining me I'll see you next time.